Hey there guys, it's Plumore here with another episode of Eastside Hockey Manager with the Nottingham Panthers. In this episode we are going to be doing the playoffs. It's going to be a live commentary this time. So hopefully it flows better. We failed to win the league, but we came we came second, so I think we did good. Oh, what does it say our last 10? Last 10... 7-2-1 Now we're playing the Milton Keynes Lightning in uh, the playoff quarterfinals Belfast playing Sheffield so hopefully Sheffield wins Belfast if the Belfast win I can see them winning the playoffs Cardiff vs Guildford I'm predicting Cardiff to win 5 vs Edinburgh I'm predicting 5 to win I'm predicting Belfast to win too but I'm hoping Sheffield win Anyway uh, I've scouted a few players but I realised I wasn't recording but you'll see the reports on them players when they come back. I haven't done anything other than that. I just looked at a few. But anyway, so we're going to be watching the game. Hopefully it's not laggy for you guys. We're going to have key only. If it's laggy, then I'll just change it with editing. Clock speed will be fast and action speed will be normal. Here we go. First is the Milton Keynes Lightning in Nottingham. First leg's in Nottingham. Um, we've got the puck in their end. And uh, nothing really comes of it. Anyway, we're on the power play too. Just noticed that player in the box. Two seconds left on the power play. Arnold, Moros, Billingsley, Spang, and. I didn't see the other guy, sorry. But we score a goal. I uh, didn't actually. Use... Oh, Moros lights up the lamp. So, signing we made two episodes ago now, I believe, uh, scores the goal for the Panthers to open our scoring in the playoffs. Oh no, is it glitched? No, it's not glitched. <laughs> that would have been a disaster. Uh, now Milton Keynes are in the offensive zone. Garnett with the save. Uh, hopefully we can pull it away and score a goal here, but it's kind of looking like they're going to score. They were on a power play too, but they're not anymore. And they, yeah, they scored. Doucette scored. Doucette's a really good goal scorer, to be fair. Let me change this to fast because it's taken a while. Anyway, let's get back into this. Uh, end of the first is 1-1. One, one. Start of the second now. 15 minutes to go. We've got power play, even strength. Found to kill. We killed it off though. Uh, they scored. God damn it. SRE scores, assisted by Doucette, the score of their last goal. Damn, that's not good. Now we've got the the, we've got the puck in there and then Shala scores. Shala is a quality player in this game. I don't know how much he scored through the season, but he scored just then. And now it's 2 2 heading into the third. And now we're halfway through the third. Uh, I'm hoping we can at least get a tie for a victory tomorrow, although something's happening now. Uh, we clear it right down to their goalie, and he holds it for the. Whistle, Martindale, Pliny and Moros is on. It's not really fixed lines here. Actually, considering the last one was power play, forget what I just said. Uh, we're f messing around with it a bit. And just dumping, really. That's what both teams seem to be doing. Yeah, they're just dumping out the zone, trying to keep the... Trying to keep the tie, and we managed to do so. So it's 2-2 two -two in the uh, first leg of the playoffs. You're gonna have to sit through uh, the um, I don't know what to say the uh, loading screen. This thing here, where my mouse is just underneath it. The scores. So because this is live commentary, it's not going to be edited too much in detail, like cutting out all that. But hopefully, it won't take long through the rest of the games. We play Milton Keynes in Milton Keynes tomorrow, so we'll probably need to play better than we did today. Uh, yeah, April 1st. Anyway, let's keep it going. I didn't actually see the results of the other games, if they played. I'm not sure if they played to that day. But I believe they did. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's uh, do this. Male, uh, players rejecting, Guptill rejects, that's good, Lapine, 
uh, Wrestling, that's good. Bigs, that's good. Wing Quest is a one I scouted when I forgot to record. Justin Shug, that's the guy we scouted the other day. Fournier won Player of the Month. Luke Moffat won Rookie of the Month. Interesting. Okay, so now we are playing five lead, three two, on. That's a lie. Seven two on aggregate against Edinburgh. Cardiff lead six two on aggregate against Guildford, and Belfast lead five four on aggregate against Sheffield. Okay, I forgot to view the game. Uh, let's see if we win. Yes, we won. And we win four three on aggregate. And we beat Man uh, oh, Milton Keynes, my bad, sorry. Five beat Edinburgh. Cardiff beat Guildford. And yes, Sheffield won against Belfast to uh, knock Belfast out of the playoffs. So I'm going to save this here just in case anything goes wrong. But uh, it should be okay. I'm not expecting anything to go wrong. Hopefully, now we're, we're the favourites now to win the playoffs. Because we came second, obviously, but that's a huge step in the right uh, way for us there, getting Belfast out of it. So it's a good job for Sheffield there. I believe we are playing Fife next. I'm not certain. Don't quote me on that. It should tell us here where we're doing here. No, it doesn't. Never mind. Charlie Mosey won Player of the Week. Ben Folio praised. Confidence are extremely pleased with your. Oh no, not they're just pleased. Extremely secure. And NHL draft. Let's uh continue another day along, and hopefully we will have our uh who we're playing next uh for us to see. I'm thinking it's five. Don't quote me though. And uh. Yeah, we'll see in just a minute. Not responding. Okay. Doty has had 187 penalty minutes. Okay, so. Scouts watch Hamilton. Yes. This was one of the players I scout. Power forward, first line. Assume, classic player. Interesting. Uh, Timo Aaronen. Ooh, he looks quite good, actually. Uh... Offensive defenseman, we'll add him to our shortlist. Uh, Tommy Jokinen, two way forward, poor man's Danny Kearney. Okay, let's keep going. Skilled forward, first line, 30 points. Play strong, classy, modest player. Starts by Philly something. Uh, exhibit sports, yeah, classy, two way forward. Interesting. Elite League semi-final draw. Nottingham will play Sheffield. Interesting. Uh, Nottingham Panthers facing rival Sheffield Saints in the playoff finals. There'll be no love lost between these two teams. Thrilling action in the eight regular season games between the two teams. Nottingham outscored Sheffield 31 to nine as they swept the series eight wins in regulation out of the eight games. That is standing as a very good stead there. So. Uh, yeah, hopefully we can expect that to continue through the playoffs. We had a good game against Milton Keynes to win away. It was close though, so we almost didn't make it, but we we did make it. So let's. Uh, I forgot to save it, so let's save it now. Stephen Lee wouldn't need to sign Phillips. Forty nine points. We haven't got many points in our team this season. Garnett played well though this year. Let me save. Just in case anything bad happens or something, I don't expect it to. Uh, Paul Crowder, uh, Chris Lawrence, not very good. Let's be honest. Though he's a big guy. 28 points in 50 something games, 40 penalty minutes. I don't think he's a great player at all. But anyway. Let's uh, see now, we're coming to the end of this loading screen, if there's anything interesting happening today. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for the support as well, it's been really good to see. So thank you guys. Team, mm, apply. 
We're trying to still make it to the NHL, so we may as well apply for the Team USA. Get uh get us more noticed. I don't know what our reputation is looking like. We might check that in this next break bit, but should I think we should be a good reputation now. Either way, we we're doing well in Nottingham. Like I said in the first episode, I believe our goal is to win the Stanley Cup in the NHL. But first, we gotta make it to the NHL, which is gonna be difficult. I don't believe we can do it. Uh, general manager stats. Yeah, we've got good reputation. Okay, scouts impressed by Wacy Hamilton, 27 center defensive forward first line. Uh, could have trouble adapting to Great Britain. There's no point of signing them, really. Uh, six foot three. He's contracted to Canucks, but when's his contract end? This year. Uh, I think we'll add him to the shortlist. Um, Jordan Subban's contracted to the Canucks. Uh, I don't think we'll get him. In terms of potential, this guy was the one I was talking about. Joshua Win Winquist. I believe he's going to be a stud if we can get him. I don't know if we will be able to get him, but you never know. Two way forward. Interesting. We'll add him to the shortlist. He's not on our main stay of players. Anyway, let's simulate to the seventh. 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 I can't say that word. What is wrong with me? Anyway, we're going to watch this game again. I forgot to watch the last one, but never mind. I don't think it actually affects the game, I think it just still simulates it exactly the same. But yes, let's uh we're just gonna be getting to the end of the playoffs, we're not gonna do the whole month. But we should be good. It should be a longer episode than normal too. So if you like that then good. If not then I'm sorry. But um it's the best way I can think of doing it. White jewel. Who's that? Interesting. Uh, now we're playing Sheffield today. Let's view this. Let's see if we can make it through. This should be a huge pivotal game in the league this year. In the playoffs. And Sheffield have got it in our end. So it's not looking good at all. Sheffield score. God damn it. Wallace from War and Fitzgerald. Sheffield have got an early lead. That could put Panthers on the back foot. Got power play. Nothing comes. We've got another power play. And yes, Clark scores, assisted by Phillips and Sove. That's a good 1-1 one -one now. Uh, five minutes or so to go in the th first. Almost said the third there. Now Sheffield are breaking up with it. And god damn it, they scored war again. Oh, he's a good player, you know. I would be looking at signing him if he wasn't so old. But I can only see his stats declining from here. Now Panthers have got it. Yes, Clark again from Breezeboy, Breezebois and Delago. I don't know how to say that guy's name. Uh, power play. Okay, start the third. We've got a power play. We could not make anything of it. Now they've got a power play, and it looks like they can make something of it. And they do. Faldix from Wallace and Parant. Sheffield are carrying the lead. 3-2. 10 minutes going to third. Can we pull it back? Uh, there's two minutes to go. Panthers have got it. Breaking up. Clark to the defenseman. We're making a game of it. Uh, we get it around boards. And again, we're just dumping it now. Uh, they dump it into our zone. 50 seconds to go. Go on, skate. Whoever that was is either really slow or just wasn't putting up in. Bussy Harris. Come on, Arnold. He does not win the face off. Sheffield have got it, let's go. Mor Moros. Oh, we, we're out of the playoffs in the semi finals, that's disappointing. Uh, Survey got a 6. Mm. Some of the players didn't play to the highest of standards there. Oh well. So, we, we had an OK season, we came second in the league. So, what can you do? Uh. Some of our players had a lot better games than them. Anyway, that's that. That game against Sheffield's over and we are officially out. 
I'm predicting Fife to win this. And then I'm predicting Sheffield to win the playoffs. That's my prediction. I don't know anything, obviously. Anyway, let's see what happens. All the playoffs take place in the Nottingham Arena, so... That's just something about this league. Anyway, let's see, uh... See who can get the W. And then we're going to start building on next season's team straight away. I'm not going to wait. Cardiff won. Okay, I got my prediction wrong. Cardiff versus Sheffield. Uh, the bronze medal game. We take on five. We split the series. Cardiff outscored. They clinched the series. Yeah, but we got the series as well. Doubts on his future. Do you reckon we could sign him again? No, he doesn't want a new contract. Uh, what if we defend him? Yes, fans pay tribute. Stands by Doty. That's a wrong tab. Doty, will he join us now? He's more happy, maybe? No. Okay. Oh well. Uh, let's go up five for playing against the Panthers tomorrow in the third, fourth place game. Martin Dale seems practice. Okay. Here we go. Third, fourth place game. Doesn't really matter, but obviously we'd rather win. Anyway, let's see what happens. Pardon me. Uh, so far in the first, it's 0-0. Uh, now we're breaking up. And we score. Delago from Moros. And I didn't see who the other player was, if I'm honest. Probably Arnold. Well, if I was an Arnold, he scored. My bad. Anyway, one minute to go in the third. And it looked like five will score. Can we put this a tiny bit faster? As this game isn't really important. One minute to go. Yeah, they scored. Okay. They continue to have a power play though. Interesting. Let me see that. Penalties. Two minutes for cross checking. But the penalty didn't go out when they scored. Okay, game view. Actually, let's put it back so we can actually see what's happening. And, uh, yeah. We had a power. No, they had a power play, sorry. They didn't convert on it. Neither did we in our one. And the second ends in not in two one to five. God damn it, guys! Come on, what is happening? Uh, continue. Can we equalise and maybe get the victory? Five uh, getting a power play here, and it looks like they're going to score again and win the game. That's frustrating. We had a good season, but came to a bad end there. Let's uh definitely not re-sign this team. A lot of this team anyway. A lot of players I'm looking at to bring in that I think can do a better job than what we've done this season. I'm hoping, like the very first episode said, was building a dynasty. So that's kind of what I'm looking for again to completely rebuild. Other than Mor Moros, who signed on a multi-year deal. Looks like no one else is coming back. But, yeah, we're just dumping it. We're not even trying to win. That's uh, annoying. Okay, is there any way we can change that? Tactics. Oh, we can't change tactics. Great. In six seconds, so we wouldn't have done anything. But, oh well. Why would you ice it? Come on, man. Oh well. End of the game. Ratings. Uh, none of them really played overly bad. We played Galbraith. It's interesting. I don't know if we played him in the other games as well, but Garnett's obviously the starter, so. Oh well, we lose. Uh, we came fourth. Fans sh wouldn't be too happy with that. And now here's the final game. And this is where we're going to end the episode. And next episode, I'm going to start rebuilding from here to the end of the month. And then we're going to go monthly again. So. Yes, let's see how this goes. Uh, ECHL is still playing. Uh, I believe we'll do a lot better next season, so... Yeah, stick around for next season. Anyway, let's see what happens. Cardiff win 2-0. Okay, I think I got both of my predictions wrong then, because I had five winning and Sheffield winning the league. Well done, Cardiff. Uh, okay, that's that. And let's look at the playoff tree. 
We beat Melton Keynes, Sheffield beat us, Cardiff beat Sheffield, Cardiff won. So congrats to Cardiff. We've got a very strong lineup, so we won't put it past them. I'm surprised Belfast didn't do anything either, so I got a hiccup. And uh yeah. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time and uh yeah, have a good day. Peace.